How's it going guys and welcome back for a new video. This right here is the one second one stack auto and I'm doing this video here while I'm on vacation so while I'm enjoying the hot weather you guys are going to have a cold evening. But other than that guys let's go ahead and go straight into the cannon. Now this right here is very easy to build and very easy to use. It's very simple to uh, understand as well so it shouldn't be a problem. The first thing you're going to do is that you're going to find two buttons as you can see. This one right here shoots it once if this one here is not on. But if these two here is on, it's going on full auto. So let's go ahead and press the button. Make sure you have sand and then it should be able to work. There we are, perfect. This one here goes quite far. It goes like 30-ish chunks. Um, I did count it before and then I realized I had to take some of the power off and then it of course shoots further than that. So it should go at least 30 chunks and then you should be good to go with this cannon right here. I'm not going to go ahead and record too much of this, but as you can see already now we at least 22 chunks in. Uh, so it shouldn't be a problem, anything at all, which is awesome. So going into the cannon real quick before we end the video kind of early. Um, I don't have, I didn't have the time to record these videos here. Well, I did if I didn't plan a little bit better. But anyways, let's go ahead and take a look at the cannon. So this right here is uh, how it looks like, and this is how you make it shoot every second. This one here is extremely powerful if you have a reverse hybrid behind it, because you can wait bases with this if you wanted to. Up here, we have this massive amount of power, and we are using this to go up to 32 chunks or 30 chunks up. This right here is the realignment. We're using this to realign it so you can go east to west as well. Down here we have the scatter. You can easily disable it by just taking the redstone out. It has 6 TNT, so it shouldn't be a problem to destroy, destroy Obby. And all the way down here we have the sand and we have the scatter getting pushed out. Then we have the realignment going right down there and the power right here. This right here is how you boost both the sand, which is coming in here, and you have the scatter coming in here. Now I'm going to disable it real quick here, but that is that. That is how that works. Now this right here is pretty much it. That's uh, that's pretty much the cannon. It's extremely simple. This right here is the clock. So this right here goes. I, I guess it goes this way. Goes over here and then presses it again. Extremely simple. So it shouldn't be a problem to get that uh, working fine. Over here we have the redstone for the booster and then over here we have the redstone for the two pistons to figure out when things should go out and that is pretty much the cannon guys hopefully you guys enjoyed this video here and if you did remember to like this video here remember to comment down below especially if you have any questions if you have any suggestions or any problems with this cannon whatsoever please make sure to leave a comment down below but as always guys i want to thank you guys for watching this video here and if you enjoyed remember to subscribe to my channel my name is dexter and i'm out